we know uh, that eventually higher interest rates will slow the economy. People will uh, start to uh, uh, not have, you know, if you, if you have to pay more for a mortgage, you won't go out and buy such an expensive house. That'll cap the rise in asset prices, which is in some ways even more worrying socially than, than, than current prices. I mean, we're up, what, we're up actually 6% on the RPI at the moment, uh, not just the 4.2% on the old RPI, uh, but we're up 10% in house prices. So how do you actually have afford a house? No, so it has a, it, it, but it will at the margin, the signal that we're on a path to higher interest rates will eventually curb inflation. We did that in the 80s. It was very unpleasant, but it had to be done. It was done by Paul Volcker. Head of the Fed. But, but, but in the 80s, you and I both remember, I mean, the numbers were huge. That's partly my point, that we've had interest rates at such a low level for so long that the rise is bound to be sort of microscopic. And, and I just can't see families sitting around the dinner table tomorrow saying, oh, you know, got to curb our spending now because of that interest rate that might rise that might come. And, and also, there is an irony, isn't there, in it, that, that you're being charged more for mortgages, credit cards, bank loans and the rest of it to stop you having to pay more for the stuff that you really need, like food and clothes and cars. Yeah, yeah. look, um, uh, you're absolutely right. Um, this is not going to change suddenly. There will be a wodge of inflation coming through next year. Globally, the central banks will start very slowly I think they should have actually started rather earlier, but yes. you know, they will start very slowly to crank up interest rates. You can't run a society which has six percent inflation, four percent inflation, and 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 one percent or half of one percent or a quarter of one percent interest rates. You you can't do that. You're caning your savers too much. Um, so I think that what will happen will be that gradually, slowly. Probably too late. Mm. The, the world central banks will start raising rates, and they'll. And actually, they probably won't have to go to the stratospheric levels that they did all those years ago, because there's such a wadge of debt around. Mm. Everybody's so indebted that that quite a small increase will start to curb the curb this froth that's currently in the global economy.